Once connected, two cranes took the load of the stage and the transport gear beneath it was removed. Two cranes were used to lift the stage horizontally first before going vertical so the engines on the bottom would not be damaged. This process is referred to as breakover. Once vertical, the stage was tied in place. There was an anticipated lull in the wind, so the lift was scheduled to take place the next morning. The next morning, the stage was lifted onto the B2 stand, 11 stories high. A large crew was needed to steady and help maneuver the core stage into place before it was lowered into position for a series of tests prior to its maiden flight. <laughs>